through center on left wing. It's Dollywall playing across here for Foreman. Throws it on, rebound, loose in front, he scores! Reed Gunville on the rebound off of a Quinn Foreman shot, buries it over the blocker side of Kozlowski, and the Warriors take a one to nothing lead. There of Kozlowski, plays around to the right side, trying to send it in there is Dubois, at the right half wall, now finding that, Sodergren, bottom of the left circle, he scores! Kozlowski just couldn't squeeze those pads hard enough he thought he had it and just squeaked through. Barely got across that goal line, giving the Warriors a 2 nothing lead. Pass two on one. Here's Sodergren in on the right wing. Back door. Epp couldn't get the pass as Hirose made a nice play to interrupt that play by Coffey and spilled ahead for Jared Marino. Walks in left wing. Shoot. Stop there. Kozlowski rebound loose. And it was chipped just wide by Martin. Half wall work up top here for Fuller. Midpoint right side. Booth a drive. He scores. Drops it for Clayson in the slot, back in front. Great save by Kozlowski with the left pad. Left point, dropping it there, walking in. Booth slot, shot there by Mitchell. Stopped nicely there by Farkas and rimmed off the boards and out there by Allen. Today with me, I have the guys from Thrash Wrestling and my co-host for this intermission is the voice of Thrash Wrestling, Big Steve McCarthy. Thank you very much, Carly. It's good to see you guys here. Let's hear it for the Warriors, everybody. Come on. Brought out with us the Okanagan. Logan Interior Champion, Top Drawer Michael Moore. So ladies and gentlemen, it's time for me to turn this opportunity over to your Okanagan Interior Champion, Thrash Wrestling Champion, Top Drawer Michael Moore. Hey, y'all better uh, turn up the heat in here. It's a little bit cold. I don't know if you noticed. This is how it's going to work, everybody. If Big Steve McCarthy wins this shootout, someone in Section 114 is going to win four tickets to the show. If Top Drawer Michael Moore wins, a Salmon Arm fan is going to win the passes. All right, let's begin. Steve? Okay, let's do it. You gotta be two. Is in the slot, Blanchard right circle, hold, shoot, scores. Those are the ones that hurt Trevor. Those are the ones you gotta, your goalie's gotta make that save. That one getting through the arm, you know darn well that Coach Furster is saying the same thing. You gotta make that save. Power play is drive, stopped by Farkas. Yeah. Able to hang on to that rebound and cover it up here. 3 2 Salmon Arm carries in across the blue line in the left wing between his legs, centered in front. Had Foreman there, couldn't get the tip. Right side, Retigliano shoots through traffic, deflected on by Epp at the top of the right circle, and that must have hit a body. I don't know if Kozlowski saw that. Russell, who skates ahead across the blue line, now working against Fuller, stops up left circle. Shot stopped by Kozlowski. That's a great little rush there by John Russell, who's a guy that we haven't seen a whole lot of that out of, but that's a nice little play that he had there with Quinn Foreman, and maybe with a chance to play up in the lineup, he might be able to do that. Yeah, you know what, I, I thought coming out of the, the training camp, I thought we were gonna have huge things out of him, and you're right, we haven't seen a, a ton out of him, but you know, tonight I thought he's had a strong game, and that was definitely a strong play. 
Always strong defensively. Here's Foreman. Great move. The cut back in front. Russell scores. There we go. That's, you know, he's rewarded. Hard work. That's what he's going to get. You know, we haven't seen much out of him already, but tonight we have, and he's been rewarded with a goal tonight to tie it up at three. Great hustle play, and there's a little bit of a skirmish there going after him while he's on the ground. Right circle. Bulldog hold. Shoot. Stop by Farkas. Rebound. They score. Now it's found here by Retigliano, and the captain's ahead on left wing. Across the blue line, his shot stopped, rebound loose there. And jousting for that puck was Russell trying to contend with Watts. Bariga right side, Bulldog fires. The back door, Bariga somehow didn't put that in, but now Bulldog does. Right side for Allen, gets it ahead through center there for Tamaris. Tipped in, Wilton's got a chance, left circle, dropped it off, a shot by Judding off the post. Worked back behind the net for Reed Gunville now. Right side, Clayson award goal, Foreman scores! Nice, nice call. Off the, off the salmon arm stick right off the Foreman stick and he spotted that goal right, right there. Great goal by Foreman with only a minute and 47 seconds left. The Warriors are right back in it. Elmo for Foreman, left circle, he holds right side, Dollywall. Doesn't fire now, midpoint, Harrison shoots! Stopped by Kozlowski, I'm not sure how he made that glove save so calmly. 47.5 seconds to go. He holds back right side, Harrison a shot. There's Gunville back in front, there's a chance, side of the goal, Kozlowski somehow makes the save. Free to Booth on the left wing, he'll carry ahead with 15 seconds, wide open goal and he scores. Coach Ryland Furster after a tough 6-4 loss for your group tonight against the Salmon Arm Silverbacks and another night of scoring uh, four goals. You scored four last night and Salmon Arm scored four here tonight so the offense is going a little bit uh, but I know it's you know about 15 minutes after the game is done but maybe give us your first takes on what you thought from behind the bench for tonight's hockey game. Well we blew another lead last night we have a four goal lead and uh, you know can't seem to hold tonight we have a two goal lead and um, you know can't seem to hold it either again full marks to them they're a good team and you know I thought their goalie made some you know some real timely saves for them and um, you know that's a lot of times that's such a big thing in hockey making those timely saves and I thought that kid did that down there for them.